Located in Tampa, Florida, Heat Pipe Technology specializes in the manufacturing and installation of heat pipe systems in commercial and industrial applications for enhanced dehumidification and energy recovery. In 2011, Amelie Arena was annually ranked near the bottom among NHL teams' ice quality. That is not surprising in a humid climate such as Tampa's, making it difficult and uneconomical to keep the air dry enough for top quality ice. The arena was generating an air temperature near the ice of 65 degrees Fahrenheit and 60% relative humidity when the league recommended it to be closer to 60 degrees Fahrenheit and 40% relative. There are many systems available that produce such low dew points, and the initial plan was to use a gas heat desiccant system to be installed on the roof. Unfortunately, this was neither desirable from a first cost nor an operating cost standpoint. The goal was to find a more efficient system that would allow them to better condition nearly 500,000 cubic feet per minute of air. HPT's wraparound dehumidification heat pipes DHPs, utilize the phase change of the working fluid to both pre-cool the air before entering the cooling coil and reheat the air after the cooling coil using the energy captured upstream. This reduces the load on the cooling coil, allowing more latent cooling to be done to achieve a more depressed dew point, in addition to nearly eliminating the need for reheat. This system also has no moving parts and requires almost no maintenance. When League opted for a less stringent air condition of roughly 65 degrees Fahrenheit and 45% relative humidity, this allowed the design team to simply lower the chilled water set point while replacing the 12 indoor air handlers with new HPT heat pipes wrapped around a dual six row cooling coil. According to Mike Tapone, president of Tapone Mechanical Services, who handled all HVAC construction and assisted with the design, not only did the heat pipe solution allow us to keep all construction inside the existing mechanical rooms and off the roof, which greatly reduced first costs, but allowed us to reduce overall energy consumption as well. Despite the need for colder water from the chillers, it literally went from a maintenance nightmare to a dream. I really compliment ownership on doing what needed to be done, and it certainly paid off. At design conditions, the heat pipe's pre-cool effect removed close to 350 total tons from the cooling load of the arena, while the reheat effect put back all this heat to supplement the reheat system. This has resulted in an estimated savings upwards of $50,000 per month. For more information on our technology, please visit our website at www.heatpipe.com.